Stop assuming borders are always straight lines. Alaska's panhandle breaks the rules in the wackiest way. Ever wondered why that is? Let's rewind to some international drama. Back in the early 1800s, Russian explorers claimed Alaska, including its long, skinny southeastern edge. Meanwhile, the British were pushing west across Canada, and the two empires started butting heads over this strategic coastline. To avoid a fight, they signed a deal in 1825. Russia could keep a thin strip along the sea, but only up to 55 kilometers inland, and only if mountains stood that close to the coast. The problem? The wording was so vague, nobody really knew where to draw the line. Fast forward, the U.S. buys Alaska, the gold rush makes the land even more valuable, and Canada tries to contest the border. But after a big international tribunal, the jagged, twisty panhandle officially stayed with the U.S. That's why Alaska's border looks so odd today.